To Jackson State, several students now on suspension, their fates pending further investigation into alleged hazing. As 12 News' Shea O'Connor shows us, there have been mixed reactions from students on campus. <laughs> Students across Jackson State University campus say they are still in shock at a call recently made by university officials to suspend several members of the Prince and J-Sets dancers in Sonic Boom marching band. This after allegations of hazing. I really heard that they were having like things going on with hazing and a lot of the J-Sets are suspended and a lot of them that were incoming freshmen that weren't crabs have to go start all over again and be crabs again. But I know JSU has a very strict no hazing policy. So even the ones that were involved in the hazing that were being hazed, they got suspended as well. At this time, we don't know the nature of the hazing, but in a statement released by JSU administrators, we're told, quote, Jackson State University has temporarily suspended several members of the Prancing J sets and Sonic Boom over allegations of hazing pending the outcome of an investigation. Because JSU does not condone such behavior, strict policies are imposed to maintain a safe environment that promotes academic excellence. You know, Jackson State University is going to handle that the way they do. I just know uh, at our recent game, we only had three JSS instead of the usual number, so I'm not really too sure on exactly, you know, what the issue or the deal is. Um, but I do hope everything is okay with them and, you know, everything uh, goes back to, you know, normal. For now, university officials say the matter is being investigated by student affairs. We have no reason at this time to believe anyone was seriously injured. In Jackson, Shea O'Connor, 12 News. Now, this isn't the first hazing allegations made against the J-SETs. We are told in 2015, nine members were suspended following a hazing investigation.